<laughs> you make yourself laugh. Hello. No! Wow. wow. It's literally aquarium. It seems like in this video, two things are broken. Catching up with the balance of life. Max's scar looks much better and oh, there's worms. Good day. It's a new video, new week, new day. We are currently at the north of Cat Island to spend a few days here because there's a lot of good spearfishing and all along the well, way. We don't know that. There's a lot of coral heads. There's supposed to yeah, supposedly a lot of good snorkeling, spearfishing, and we only have a month left here, guys. So we better make do with what the time we better make do of the time we have left here. And along the way to the anchorage where we were gonna go, Max spotted some coral heads, so we Let's go check it out. Stopped in the middle of no Nowhere so that Max could dive his coral heads. Yes, I have a potato face, but I just wanted to pop on here to say that um, we were on our way to Cat Island. We're almost there, just an hour away, north of Cat Island, and then we spot this coral head. Oh no! We broke our anchor, windless. So one of Max's most effective distressor is swimming and or spear fishing. So once we anchored safely and took a look at the damage, he jumped in the water to gather his thoughts and it's pretty effective de-stressor because I get a dinner out of it. He's coming back, that means he got something. And for my part, you'd be happy to know that my ear infection is back. Woohoo! Don't we love that? I thought I healed, I took all my antibiotics, did the whole full length treatment, even over, and it came back. Guess what he got, guys? I can't bite his head, I can't kill it. So weird. I think it's a macro, I hope it's a macro. Might be a pedito, in which case you gotta eat it. Around the head, down to the ventral fin. I wanna go in a nice straight line all the way down the length of this macro. I'm so confused. I'm still like astounded. I just turned around, I was looking at the reef. It was just swimming. It yeah, you did, were so I literally quick. went and then he didn't even dodge. I didn't even have time to clean up all the lines before you got back. Really? So we're gonna eat sashimi. While we wait for the main meal. Can you move your grubby feet? It's sashimi time, baby. You take your little piece of ma mackerel, you dip it in the soy sauce. Mmm. Is it good? Mm-hmm. Morning. I told her to quit whining. <laughs> <laughs> Self-laugh. Hello. Morning. Yep. The ear infection is back, but my body is fighting it, right? Yeah. I'm fighting the ear infection and it's gonna go away. Yeah, it's gonna go away, right guys? Yes. Because we can't be dealing with another three weeks of being out of it. Nope. Because it's uh I got videos to edit, I got videos to film, I can't be out of business the whole Six freaking weeks time. Out of, out of I was just looking at this, I was wondering if maybe you're the fish you caught yesterday. It is. Spanish mackerel, you got this yeah. one. But he spearfished guys, isn't that pretty cool? It was actually really good. I think I didn't slice it thin enough for the sashimi to be tasty. Yeah, so I like the sashimi, my many didn't. For me, the sashimi was the best one we've had yet. Really? Yeah. What I think we have to do is put the fish in the freezer before we fillet it. It gets cold and hot and then you get a nice sushi cold. Okay, wait, sorry. We're just 
blabbering around about my ear, about the fish, but here's where we are. We are in Cat Island, the north of Cat Island. It's our last night here before mm -hmm. we do the jump to Eleuthera. But today we're just gonna go run coral heads. We're probably gonna find a big coral head with a dinghy, go to it, jump in. And try to fix the windlass. I don't know if we'll be able to fix it, but we'll definitely be able to see what's wrong. Oh look, it, go, it turns, right? Yeah. But also, I can just force it over the yeah, other way. Soon as okay, I just have to show you guys because I can't believe we're the only ones in this anchorage and it's just so beautiful. Look it, I can see so clearly in the water. I can even see our anchor chain all the way up to the anchor itself. No one's here. No! I dropped the I dropped the jar with the piece. Oh shit, can you go in? I'm sorry, Max. He's not happy with me. There. You found both pieces? Just two. You found them? Bro, they see one. Okay, one, I'm sure it's around there. Now that you're what, do you want to go spear fishing? Uh-huh. Let's go. How do you want to go about this? I want to find that big coral head and the just keep searching the hole. And get ready with the anchor. Wow. wow. It's literally an aquarium. Wow, this is so cool. I've never ever seen this clear of water. Works out well because I can't go in <laughs> because of my ear infection. The doctor said, no, 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 no swimming. I don't even need to swim because I can see the coral reef from up here. It's so cool. So he wasn't even spearfishing, he was filming with his new toy. How was it? Good. Oh, I had it under my head. That was weird. So Good. pretty? It was really pretty. Just so tranquil. Loads of little fish that I could shoot usually, but since we're here, Don't forget we're anchored. I'm not gonna waste bullets and something. We're trying to find coral heads, but it's kind of tricky. <laughs> On the way, we met a local fisherman who was happy to point us in the right direction for some of his spear fishing spots. What a life that guy has. Just comes out every day, gets himself a little dinner snack, chilling. I mean, maybe we're just lucky that right now the water's crystal clear, but it's beautiful. Don't forget your glove. Wow, what is that? A logger. Oh, nice. I don't know if I want to gut it here though. Let's gut it later, maybe? Yeah. Guys, can you hear that? No, you can't, because me neither. There's no sound. It's so quiet. This is truly magical. Truly magical. I feel very grateful right now. So lucky. I love this, this is so special. Even if our windless anchor broke, this is completely worth it. Although it wasn't at the expense of our windless, that was our own mistake. Oh my gosh, we're back, finally. It's 3.46, what a day. Max spearfishing all day, he hasn't even eaten yet. It is now the afternoon. We have relaxed, recuperated. As you can tell, I got sunburned. Wah, 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 wah. So anyways, we are meeting with two of our new friends, I guess, that we met at a previous anchorage on the beach. We're gonna do a bonfire. Uh, we met them kind of thanks to new people, like that was the uh, sea people. That was what connected us. I was like, oh, I saw you guys on sea people, right? And then we just hung out. But anyways, I prepared plantains and I prepared quinoa and rice and beans and all that good stuff. Are you out of it here, honey? Oh yeah, he shaved his mustache in like one centimeter. So I don't know why people do this. I actually can't tell the difference. Really? That's... No, I did not notice.
How do these things kind of regretting our choice of doing a bonfire? We're being attacked by if there is mosquitoes a God, and no CM. How could you create these things? We were just trying to have a cute little moment here on the beach. <laughs> <laughs> this is what it ends up to be like. Look at those two fish. Wow. Good morning, you lovely people. It's another beautiful crystal clear day. I mean, this is the best kind of water. You know, you've amazing visibility, no swell. Let's have a look at the water. Would you look at that? <sighs> Nothing better than standing naked on your bow, enjoying the sun, enjoying this pristine water. These are our buddies. We had a barbecue on the beach with them last night. They're called Heavy Metal. And they, they have an amazing, amazing big aluminium sailboat that can literally do anything. That thing, they sailed it all the way from California. I don't know if you can see that core head. See the car head right there? On the first day we arrived, that's where I jumped in and shot that mackerel. I've never seen a mackerel, let alone in this shallow. Maybe I'll find another one. Over there. But yeah, we're gonna jump in the water today and see what's up. So our friends from Heavy Metal took us to check out the turtles in the creek. And there wasn't just one turtle or three, but dozens. And this place was just teeming with sea life. It was really special. I've, I've never seen something like that. Then they invited us on their boat for dinner. And remember the coconut that we got in the last video? Well, we finally opened it, but there's definitely a bit How's more practice going? needed to get to the level of the guy from our trip to Belize. Hello. Hello. <laughs> it's nice. I want one of these. So, if we ever get invited on your boat, Max will climb your mast. <laughs> <sighs> this is a really cool al aluminum boat. Are you gonna come down? Yeah. And so this is the part where we slack a bit on filming duty. Uh, things happened and the craziest being that Max fell and cut open his eyebrow. And it wasn't very pretty so I didn't film. But the next day was time for us to leave because the winds were shifting. So we sailed to Eleuthera and on the way we caught a tuna, which was pretty cool. And we also saw these crazy things jumping out of the water and I think it's whales, but I'm not quite sure. So if you know, please, please tell us because uh, it was quite, it was like a massive body jumping out of the water and splashing, but you can't see it on the video. It's just too far away. You, you saw it? It's a whale. I just saw the end of the splash. You saw it, right? Oh my gosh. And on our way, we noticed a town that was not yet marked on Google Maps. And we discovered it was actually one of Disney's new secret resort. And you can find out more about it because we made a short that we recently posted on our YouTube. So go check it out. Hello, it's the next day and a lot of things happened already today. And we didn't film because it was just a bit messy, hectic. And we moved. So we went from Cat Island and we're now in Eleuthera in Rock Sound. And it's freaking awesome here. I really love it. People are so nice. The vibe is good. The energy is great. We went downtown. We, the laundry mat guy wasn't there. So we took yeah. the laundry all over the place for no reason. And then we went to the supermarket and found out that $17 yogurt does exist, yeah. which was mind blowing. I'm Max's. Yeah. Scar looks much better and I don't have a before because I need to, uh, that was nasty. We need to put another bandage on it now though. And we went to the doctor's. Clinic, yay. What? We went to the clinic. Yeah, we which went is honestly the best clinic we've seen. Yeah. And we went to the doctors for my ear because the infection is only getting worse and worse. We discovered that they misdiagnosed my ear infection and now yeah. I have the right she, medication. She just had a mushroom. Yeah. Hopefully in three days it'll be gone and I can go back into the water. Let's hope. Anyways, along the way, Max caught a tuna on his lure. I caught a barracuda. By the way, we ate that barracuda. And you know what? We didn't get sick because it was under three feet. There's very little chance they have cicatera under three three feet is what we read. Again, we're not pros, so don't take our advice ever, whether it's sailing or anything else. Yeah. This was like not even one foot, and uh, I think it was fine. Yeah. So we ate it, it was actually freaking delicious. We love barracuda, but we were also lucky and we caught tuna, and this is what we're eating today. Oh, we don't even know if this has worms though. What do you mean? Oh, you don't know. Mm. 
Our friend just fished as needle fish and it has worms in it and now Max is worms. scared that our tuna has worms. Okay, well I Okay, anyways. That has nothing to do with what I want to touch. It seems like in this video, two things are broken. Our, our anchor windlass and now our stove top. We thought we were on a good run and that everything was smooth. Here we are catching up with the balance of life. The good and the bad. It's a balance. It's yin and yang, guys. So you come right up into the front. Oh, let's come right into the front. Do the same on this side from the wing. I have my little rice cooler installation here and the wind's helping us too. Oh, oh, wow, that's really, that's really good. Oh, there's worms. Just kidding. <laughs> Thanks for watching this week's video. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.